those pictures, pop those pictures, pop those pictures. Hi guys, this is the big toe on a walk of life. This week we're going to be taking you to Germany. This is a trip that my bride and I took uh, in 2007. My son was living in Germany because he was in the Air Force and he would live there for years and in a little town and a little house and Cindy and I went there as a vacation and some of these pictures are just spectacular of the, the houses and the gardens that just normal people have. Uh, we were going to Germany and being an electrician I was thinking oh we're going to this third world country but when I went there I was shocked at the fact that their electrical system is really integrated with solar and wind turbines and also they have a whole different uh, electrical voltage that they put into their system and I think it's really much more advanced than what we have here in the United States but outside from that I was surprised at how much care these people took in their houses and in their gardens. Their gardens are absolutely beautiful. And this was just a little town uh, outside. Uh, I, I don't know what the name of the town was. We stayed there for a few weeks. But come and enjoy these pictures. And really, if, if you got a minute, take a look at some of these gardens. They're absolutely beautiful. I'll continue on with this vacation series uh, when we went into Europe. Uh, and I hope you guys like them. Come along for the ride, take a look at them, and have a wonderful day. This is the house where we were staying. That's the neighbors. This is the backyard. They had a nice fenced in yard for the dog. And then beyond the fence, they had horses. But let me tell you something the German dogs are dumber than ours because I played with this dog all day and I could not get him to fetch anything. All he did was just sit there and look at me. The neighbor showed us her garden. The flowers were absolutely beautiful. Cindy and I took a walk, but because I didn't know the area and didn't speak the language, I made sure I took a picture of the street sign so I knew where to get back if I could ask somebody.
boxwoods were spectacular. One of the neighbors had a 50 year wedding anniversary, so the neighbors all got together, trimmed up their bushes, and they made these panels to put on this guy's house, couple's house, for their 50th wedding anniversary. And a lot of people in the neighborhood just got together and helped. a windmill museum which had a windmill that was built in the 1840s. It was pretty unique. We went into some small towns afterwards and they were just charming. This was the town center, and I think that one building with the wooden crosses on it is the oldest building in the town.
I think they have a different policy on animals than we have here because I've noticed that there were a lot of dogs and cats in public places. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Next week, uh, we are going to be going to either Paris, we're going to be going to the French countryside, Normandy, and other surprises that are in store. So, thanks for watching. Hope you liked it, and hope to see you again next week. You guys have a wonderful week.